from Warner Brothers Studios in Hollywood, it's the Conan Audiency Awards, celebrating excellence in the sitting and looking arts. Here now is your host, Conan O'Brien. Thank you, Ben. Thank you. Thank you. Please, thank you. This is inc What an honor that I would get to host this. This is amazing. You know, to host an award show this big, though, I need to dress the part. Bruce, do you mind? There we go. And we're done. <laughs> and I would... Thank <laughs> Bruce Brummage, everybody. No one puts on a tux. That guy shows no joy in his work. He just puts it on and then I'm out of here and he's gone. Look at this baby, look at this right here. This is the Audiency Award. These are, this may look cheap and shitty, but when you get up close, when you get up really close, you can see how cheap and shitty it really is. Look at that, look at that, it's just really. But it's an award, that's the important thing. Let's get this show started. Our first Audiency Award is for the best impression of a celebrity. And the Audiency goes to the person in seat 5D for their impression of Manny from Modern Family. Very nice. <laughs> I like the part where he's looking around. Who looks like Manny from Modern Family? <laughs> I wonder where he is. The next Audiency Award is also for best impression of a celebrity. And the Audiency goes to the person in seat 7J for their impression of David Spade. Let's give it up, David Spade. Yes! Thank God. That is Spade. Thank God. I know David Spade. He looks more like David Spade than David Spade. <laughs> the next Audiency Award is also for best impression, and the Audiency goes to the person in seat 16E for their impression of a crowned crane. <laughs> Very nice, yeah. <laughs> Don't smile, sir, you're endangered. Uh, <laughs> The next Audiency Award is also for Best Impression of a Celebrity, and the Audiency goes to the person in seat 14D for their impression of the Dancing Lady Emoji. <laughs> yes! Very good. The next Audiency goes to the person in seat 12L. It's the award for the audience member most likely to have a clogged shower drain. Next, just a guess. Next audience seat goes to the person in seat 4B. It's the award for the audience member most likely to be Tony Hawk's accountant. <laughs> this next award goes to the person in seat 6F. It's the award for the audience member most likely to have a mustache that's been impacted by the California drought. The next audience goes to the person in seat 19C. It's the award for the audience member most likely to definitely be a narc. <laughs> I think, I think he is a narc. <laughs> <laughs> He's so unhappy about being on camera. <laughs> and that mustache looks pretty fake. It sure does. You can see the tape holding it on. Hey, let's keep going. <laughs> Our next Audiency Award goes to the audience member who obviously is waiting for the camera to stop on him so he can propose to his girlfriend. Let's see if we can find him. Oh, yeah. Okay, no, no. Wait a minute, no, no, you missed him. Go back, go back, you missed him. Okay, there we are, okay, no, no, no. Hold, hold on, hold on, no, go back. Go back. Okay, 
right, well, no, forget it. Screw it. Better luck next time. <laughs> of course. I'm sure they'll both meet other people. Of course. <laughs> Like every award show, our music is provided by an orchestra down in the orchestra pit. They're right behind me, Jimmy Vino and the Basic Cable Band. Guys, amazing job, really incredible. Thank you. Great job, thank you so much. And finally, people often ask me, Conan, how is this beautiful official audience statuette really made? Well, it's an interesting process, and I thought I'd share it with you. Sometimes when a mommy's at the end of a long and especially hard day, and she's in the middle of a difficult second divorce, and wondering if she can really do this all again, or if she even deserves love, she meets a daddy made entirely of gold. And sure, this daddy's not exactly her type, but he does have one undeniable quality. He's available. Things get weird pretty fast. And what this mommy and daddy share that night is not exactly what you or I would call love, but who are we to judge? Maybe this clumsy fumbling is the closest thing they have to intimacy. Anyway, nine months later, that mommy and daddy make a little gold statue. And that's how the audience sees it.